guys welcome back to my channel um if you're new here my name is kylie and i make kind of vlogs um about my life and about college and stuff like that and other lifestyle videos also but today's video is gonna kind of be like a life update for this summer and my air just came on sorry about that but it's gonna be a life update for the summer um i haven't been uploading as regularly as I like. I kind of got in a rut where I wasn't filming anything or I would film but then I'd edit it and didn't like it so I wouldn't want to post it. But yeah, so today I just want to kind of give y'all a little update on where I've been, what I've been doing, and what my plans are. So first of all, I'll just give a quick rundown of the summer. Um, May, I just kind of relaxed and I covered some of this in a previous video, but May, I just kind of relaxed and um, hung out with my friends and enjoyed my summer. Um, June, I worked all of June and a little bit of July at the bookstore for my college. Um, I really love that job. The people there are so sweet and it's a really great place to work and I just, even the work is really fun too. I like it. But I ended up deciding to quit earlier than I had planned because I was and have been for a while, as you know, if you've watched some of my past videos, but i um, been having some mental health struggles and my goal for the summer was kind of to figure some stuff out about that before I go back to school. And so I decided I just needed to take some time off from like work and stress and take time to relax and kind of just be with myself and um, also I needed to go to a bunch of doctor's visits and stuff, so it just wasn't going to work out great to be working, um, especially with the added stress of being there and the travel and not being able to take care of stuff at home and stuff like that. So, And because we've already just been living on uh, my husband Brayden's income anyways, it wasn't really a big deal if I quit or not, like financially we were going to be fine. So I did end up quitting at the very beginning of July. Um, and then in July, I had a couple of things I did. We had a watermelon festival here in town that we do every year. Um, we had a little party with our friends for 4th of July. I spent a couple weeks relaxing. And then at the end of July, we went on a little beach trip with our friends to Biloxi, not like a crazy beach or anything like in Florida, but I'll kind of put some pictures of what I'm talking about over here, maybe some video clips too, but yeah, so that's kind of what my summer's been like so far. Um, today is July 31st, so ending, nearing the end of summer, we go back to school August 15th, um, and that's kind of where I'm wanting to catch all up on, because if you've watched some of my other videos, um, a lot of the previous semester was focusing on my college and going to school and everything I was doing because I was in nursing school and um, I thought it was pretty interesting to talk about and to share my experience and I thought it would be helpful for a lot of other people in nursing school and I'd also just really enjoy vlogging and making videos. But um, over the summer and taking several months to think about this, I am going to be changing my major this fall. Um, I really did enjoy um, my clinicals and stuff like that and my classes were okay. I just think that where I'm at mentally and where I probably will be mentally for quite a while and also just with my how emotional I am I don't think that nursing is the right career for me um, I love helping people and I love all the science behind it and I just love helping and serving others but I just don't think that I could do it for the rest of my life and I don't think that I could mentally and emotionally handle a lot of the things that come with it um, especially just the emotional like with sickness and with 
like deaths and stuff like that. I don't really think that I can emotionally and mentally handle that, especially for the rest of my life. And especially right now. So, yeah. So, thought about it for a while. And basically, what I am planning to do this fall, and I'm going to get some of this figured out tomorrow, um, but what I'm planning to do this fall is change my major to um, secondary education and be focused on like biology and science. And so my goal is to graduate and be a high school science teacher. So I know if you know me in real life, you know this is kind of expected. Um, most of my family is teachers and then if you're not a teacher you're a nurse pretty much um there's not as many nurses but like everybody in my family's teachers and they all teach at the school in my small town so it's kind of expected for me <laughs> to go into teaching and i always told myself i would never do this i didn't want to be like everybody else in my family my mom and my dad are both teachers my granddaddy was a teacher uh, all of my uncles were teachers and the majority of all the men who teach were science teachers so I always told myself I will never do this because I want to be different I want to be special I don't want to do the same thing everybody else did I don't want to be just like my dad I want to be my own person but when I think back on what really got me into nursing in the first place was the science behind it and all the prerequisites with the anatomy and physiology and the microbiology and the genetics all of that was the most interesting to me and those were the classes that I really enjoyed the most um, I love science I always have um, my dad was my high school science teacher and he's a really good teacher um, and I just loved his class because I just loved science and I love to learn and you know just thinking about it and thinking about even when I just started first considering changing my major the weight that was kind of lifted off my shoulders was kind of the first confirmation that I really needed that like this is what I need to do because um, being a nurse in school is really hard and it's really stressful and all of the people who are in nursing school right now and who have graduated I have like so much respect for you because um, it's just really hard and it's really stressful. It's a really hard time in your life. And I have just so much respect for you and for your commitment and for your hard work. But for me right now, I really just can't do that with the stress and like I can't handle it mentally right now. And you know, if I ever end up deciding to go back, like I can, that's always an option. It's never too late to go back to school. It's never too late to get a degree. Um, if I end up deciding, <clears throat> if I end up deciding maybe in the future that I don't wanna be a teacher anymore or I wanna do something else, you know, I can always go back. Um, but you know, this past week, since I've talked to people in my family and to other people and just kind of looked over the curriculum for the new major and everything I just have gotten like so much joy from it and thinking about it and thinking about my future now if I change my major has given me just so much joy like I cannot stop thinking about it I'm so excited and so happy and just like the weight that's been lifted off my shoulders like you you just don't understand like I'm just so excited and I used to kind of feel this way about nursing before I got into the actual nursing classes and that's because it was all like the science and everything and I, I completely lost that feeling I completely lost my joy and my love for it once I got into the nursing classes so I'm like so excited and so happy and I think it'll be really fun to share with you guys also, but you just, you don't understand. Like, I'm so happy. All I can think about is getting my classroom ready and teaching and like sharing and like helping people. Cause I still really love to help people, but like, you know, helping people in kind of like their most 
formative years and helping them grow and it just gives me so much joy and I've like haven't felt this way in so long about nursing and if anything nursing just made me feel terrible terrible all the time it made me feel depressed and stressed and anxious and like just terrible and here I am now and I'm like so excited and so happy and I have so much joy about it and I'm just so excited and I just like can't stop saying it and I like last night I was hanging out with my friends and I was just telling them like I'm so excited like I, I haven't been this happy about something in so long and I feel like that's really like the confirmation that I need like this is a really good choice for me because like I, I, I can't keep going to school and feeling so sad all the time about what I'm studying and like what I'm going to school for like I can't keep doing that it's not good for you and I'm just so excited so excited so anyways I just wanted to share that with you guys because well, one, it'll kind of change the type of content that I post. I'm not going to be posting nursing school vlogs anymore. I'll be posting just like college vlogs, like <laughs> like student teacher vlogs in the future. But right now, I'm still going to have to go back and kind of rework through some of the like prerequisite courses for the education degree. So I'll just be kind of taking y'all along with me and hopefully I might lose some of the subscribers, that few that I have, if some of them were interested in the nursing stuff. But if anyone was just interested in me or interested in like my day-to-day -day life or what I'm doing or how I study and stuff like that, I'm still going to be posting stuff like that. I'm still going to be posting vlogs. I'm still going to be posting, you know, house cleaning videos. That's my best video I've ever had with a house cleaning video. I'm still going to post stuff like that. I'm still going to post, you know, college vlogs, studying vlogs, all that kind of stuff. And I'm just going to be taking y'all along with me on this journey. And I'm so excited. Like, oh, I can't even stop saying it. I can't stop thinking about it. I'm so happy. But I just wanted to update you guys because I haven't been here in a while. It's been several weeks. Um, I went from posting once a week to not posting all for several weeks. So hopefully somebody missed me. But anyways, um, I will be hopefully posting again more regularly. Um, some vlogs coming up and then you know some school supplies shopping with me hauls and stuff like that i also wanted to post a video at some point maybe of like clothes i bought this summer that i'm really liking um i've never really been a super like clothes person but i bought a good bit of clothes this summer that i wanted to like share what i've liked and what i haven't liked and stuff like that um so yeah look forward to that if y'all are subscribed if you're not subscribed you should be because i will be posting again weekly and I um, think that this is going to be a really fun journey. Excuse me, for us to all go on together. But anyways, and also related to the education update, um, I will be tutoring again. If you know me in real life or if you know kind of like some of my past, um, I tutored um, from like 9th, 10th grade all the way up through 12th grade. Um, I usually tutored like elementary and middle school students, but I also tutored for like the ACT and stuff like that, but I am going to be tutoring again, hopefully this semester and maybe after that as well. And so that'll be fun to share as well, kind of like how I do that and you know what I do and stuff. And then also I'm hoping that if it works out for me with my class schedule, and I might be applying for some sub-in positions, like substitute teacher positions. And it'll be fun to kind of share that with y'all as well. So if y'all are excited and y'all are going to enjoy watching that kind of stuff, like go ahead and subscribe if you're not. And like the video, comment below any of your thoughts about all this. Um, I really hope that I'm not letting anyone down who is interested in the nursing vlogs. Um, they're all still going to be up, so you will still get to see all of my, like, first semester of clinical stuff. Um, but, yeah, so, I'm so excited. Okay, so, anyways, I will see you guys next week. I hope that y'all enjoyed the update, but I'll see you guys next week. And it should be a vlog if I'm doing my filming right and edit right on time. But, anyways, so, yeah, 
I'll see you guys next week. Thank you for watching.